Hey guys. So today I'm going to do a first impression with um, some foundation that I bought yesterday. It is the Wet n Wild Cover All Cream Foundation. I usually use the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 3-in-1, but I ran out. And when I went to Rite Aid yesterday, it was like 12 something. I didn't have that kind of money. So this was $3.99. So yeah, I'm going to see how it works out. So I already washed my face. And I'm going to be putting on the Olay Active Hydrating Cream. Because I'm dry. Mostly like around my nose. Even though my face is oily. Right when I wash my face, um, it gets super dry. Okay, first I'm going to use the NARS Creamy Concealer and Custard to cover up my dark circles and any blemish spots that I have. I have like this, I have a vein or something right here that pops out and stuff, so yeah. I would just like to say to all you girls who think that you guys need makeup to feel beautiful, try embracing like your natural skin. I don't know, this past year I haven't been wearing like a lot of makeup lately just because I'm lazy. Um, and I don't know, I just look at things different now. Just love yourself. I'm going to do half of my face with the Sonia Kashuk Tools number 4 brush. It's just like a flat brush like that. And I'll be doing the other side with a beauty blender that I got from Target. Okay. I hope this is the right color. I got medium tan. I'm just going to put it on here. Oh shoot. I got too much. Whatever. Very thick. It smells like... Not good. Like Play-Doh or something. <laughs> You could kind of tell that, I don't know if the, you could see in the camera, but like if that you're wearing makeup, it's kind of cakey. And it feels, doesn't go on smooth. Sticky. But I feel like it covered pretty well. Definitely got the right color. The scent isn't really flattering. It smells like generic Play-Doh, not the real Play-Doh, because real Play-Doh smells good, but like, not cute, but hey, I ain't got money for other makeup, so this will have to do. And I covered everything. It does feel really sticky though. Hey, let's do the other side with the beauty blender. I feel like it defined defined my pores. Not good, but hey, it'll do. So I like using this better than this. I feel like it's easier to, to apply. It's already sticky and kind of thick. Like this kind of just like cakes it on I feel like. Cover it because um, I usually do wear powder. And I'm going to be using the Bare Minerals Matte um, in medium tan with the Bare Minerals brush, uh, powder brush. I just use it to like set, you know, the makeup. This side feels more sticky than this, so maybe this makes it sticky. I have no idea. Yeah, I'm going to put on the rest of my makeup, my um, blush, and my eyebrows and stuff, and I'll get back to you guys. It definitely feels like you're wearing makeup, so I don't know if it's going to dry. Not that sticky anymore, so maybe it will dry. Could totally fill it. It is three. Yes, I start my days late. I don't wake up till like two. I will be going places and I am walking so what's the degrees it's 100 degrees not gonna be fun going to sweat so we'll see how it looks I'll give you guys an update when I come back oh and just letting you guys know I am in natural light right now got the window okay so yeah as of right now Works pretty good for $3.99, Jay saying. Oh, and I purchased this at Rite Aid for $3.99. Okay, see you guys in a bit. This 
so it's six o'clock now my hair's all messed up i had been walking outside in the 105 degree 100 degree weather for about an hour and it looks pretty good still honestly i was sweating obviously but um i didn't feel like my makeup was melting off or anything still looks the same as when i first applied it so that's good so yeah i'll check back like later tonight when i'm about to go to bed okay so it is now 2 a.m and it held up pretty good for 3.99 very good product i think i did take a nap so that's why that's why I think some makeup came off. I don't know. And I forgot to let you guys know this morning that it is a matte finish. I will talk to you guys later. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.